It's Mutant Bobblehead Day for the first 10,000 fans with extra limbs here at Three Mile Island Stadium here in Steeltown, Pennsylvania. I got seven extra knuckles, Grim. Hey, extra fingers and toes don't count. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The San Francisco 40 Nightmares take on the Blitzburg Steelheads. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hope you got your mutant tailgate buzz on. I know I did. The teams are revving up on the sidelines, and we are ready for some mutant football. Grim Blitzer along with Bricks and Bricks Jr. Yeah, Grim, I had a little eye open at myself at the mutant bloodmobile park next to the taco truck outside. Pulled a lobotomy shot. Raccoon rabies blood and red bullcrap. Hoo-hoo. Yeah, I can tell your mouth looks like a hot shaving cream dispenser. <laughs> And the defense holds that pass play to only two yards. Mm. And that'll be second and eight to go. <laughs> Boom! First and ten. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. for a first down. And it's first and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And that'll bring up second and one. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. And that'll bring up third and one. has to do a better job of watching out for that dirty trick. <laughs> the kicker should make this, but you know how it goes in this league. First down. And it's first and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. And this 
guy's like a human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. First down and seven. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. And if there's one thing I can't stand, is a pretty boy who thinks he can dance. Uh, although I am quite a fan of guts and finger fake. Oh, quite the entertainer he is. I would have to agree with you, Grim. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. on the catch nicely done second and three hot, hot one hot two hot. oh great tackle when his brain is unscrambled he'll be thinking about that hit yeah most likely in a Home. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. Oh, with a brutal hit. And that'll be second, ten, and four. Hot one. an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Wow! Did he get fried? Smells like fried smelt up here all of a sudden. And look how happy that little demon is after that score. Ooh, that means he won't drag any souls into the pits of hell for at least another three hours. Demons are so moody. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that is weird side effects, Bricks. And that's how you run. 
run the football. First down. Damn, man, I was hanging on the kettle now. <laughs> and we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Oh, that was a snooze fest. And it's first to ten. a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And the ball hits the field incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Something's like that in the quarterback. And that'll bring up third down and seven. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Uh, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. <laughs> And here comes the extra point attempt. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. <laughs> I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And that'll be second down and four. Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Tired of the quarterback tight spirals, and the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he just slipped away like, oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Oh, he's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch out, because if he gets hit, he is he caught it. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self -dying. But he seems to have worked through it. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. 
Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Let me tell you, getting shot is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shed topper for eight hours so I could shock my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel. He got blown across the room. Second down and seven. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. Looks like the defense called the ginormous dirty trick that picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got to ask. <laughs> That'll be second and eight to go. Hot one. Eight. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into... We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Graham, will you tell the interns to get us some franken-dogs and a couple of beers? I'm dry over here. I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, at least they can pee for me, too. First down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure bad. Oh, man, about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. He's got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, body. The quarterback burns his last timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore. Third down and three. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs.
First down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Hey. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gordon, did it? How good can it be? And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Is that right, Clem? That penalty makes no sense. Hey, something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. Second down and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Grim, can I kill him? And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And it's first and ten. That run is good for nine yards. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. And it's first and ten. the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play, he should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's 
like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. First and eight to go. Nine. Nine. One. Eight. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. You can tell he's a berserker because he's dropping at the mouth. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Finds his man for the first down. First and eight to go. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. And that, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second down and two. And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes to kill the court. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. And that'll bring up second and one. Two. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Man, those bones can boogie. The lack of muscle, fat, organs, and skin really makes it easy for him to dance. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two foot pots all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down and nine. Hot, hot. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one, hot two, 
Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he's off to the races. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Third down and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. And he held on to that one for a first down. First and four. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Ten yard pick up there. Normally a first down, but here he's just making up ground. Yeah. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey. Sorry, partner. Hey. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just going to pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. They call that the honeymoon offense. No, I'm not going to touch that one. That's what she said. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. A great throw and a great catch, but sadly to the wrong team. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, 
of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. His big ass will probably show up on the ring. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> hot two. Hot. 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 That's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boost dirty trick. Chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Right. Punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. <laughs> And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He blasts it and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Nicely done for a first down. First and eight to go. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. When the receiver runs away from the pass marker, that's a good clue that something's not right. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Hot two. Hot eight. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. I'm not saying the rap has been wrong, but he drove out of the field in a brand new hearse. Second down in a lot. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. There's a 
huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Mogren, that was a pass play. Rolling. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this pass for me. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Eh, big deal. Mr. Meat for Braves ran with a ball and didn't fall down. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. Two-point plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a position. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. Brings him up to a one hole highlight. And it's first and ten. And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now, like the clock is into it. He just cock blocked the clock. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stopsing time. That's why the girls call me speedy. Talk for the first down. And it's first. And that's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. He could go all the way. And they're catching up. Jump, jump, go shopping. Hey, hey, Grim, you ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? Uh, this isn't the devil, Brick. It's just one of them. Oh, that don't make it any less scary. <laughs> hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Bridges' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called... Oh, what a brutal hit! <laughs> and it's first, first time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Well, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. Second down and more. And they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not 
talking about waking up in the crack of noon. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed clean. The Steelheads walk away victorious today. It was quite a nail-biter today. They came up big with a one-point win to seal the victory. Who wants wings? I do. Make them extra spicy. I like it when they come out hotter than when they go in. I'm buying. Let's listen to the MVP. Maybe he wants some wings, too. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.